All right, we Bye. are live. Good morning, Hello. Kelly. Good morning, everyone. I never know which way to go with Happy this. coffee. Happy coffee. <laughs> you have your cute mugs, don't you, Karen? I just ran I have one. I have one. You just have one. I still only just have my prototype, which, yeah. Yeah. It's so pretty, though. It well, did turn out a, nice. This was just Vista prints. Yeah, yeah. That's I get my business cards from there. Yeah, me too. Which they reminds me, I need to do that. <laughs> I need to order more. Need to add it onto your to-do list. Let me get my um, yes. us up on here so I can look at comments because I never can see yeah. them on the. Say hello, everybody. Not to be rude. Um, good morning, everyone. How's everybody doing? Let me see where my camera is. We're over here. Um, say hello when you come in. Um, I will be reading over here. Delissa says, good morning. Good morning. Hi. Delissa. Hi, Jan and Nancy. Good oh, morning, good. everybody. All right. We're a little late getting on here. That's totally on me. It's okay. <laughs> but just, just know, you guys, when that happens, we are coming. We will be here unless we, if not, we announce, right, that we're not right. going to be here. So every Wednesday morning at 11 Eastern time, we will be here maybe a couple minutes late. So you know Unless otherwise is. specified. So I'm um, just going to say what I'm doing real quick. I'm going to paint on a record and I'm doing a heart and I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm just going to do it. I'm excited. It's just going to be a whatever. Yes. This is my color palette for the background. Oh, nice. I love it. So it's kind of like the equivalent of Queen Bee. Where am I? Queen Bee. Um, Old 57. 57. And then like a crinoline. But this <laughs> is acrylic. So it's um, yellow ochre. Whatever that blue one is. <laughs> and um, unbleached titanium white. Yeah. What's my blue one called? So, um, have, Bright you aqua ever, green. have you ever used the DIY paint on your vinyl records? Does oh, it yes. Use? That's how, uh, that's what I first did. I just wanted to try it with this. That's how most okay. of them are. Um, what I'll do is I'll usually start out with DIY. Yeah. And, um, and then add some of the, um, the acrylic just for, a little bit more vibrancy, mm -hmm. but once I seal them, the vibrance, you know, it comes out in the DIY. Yeah. But I'm like all into acrylic lately. I don't know why. Yeah. Yeah. I love, I love all the things. I love them all. I mean, there's a place for all of it. Um, and I work very similar to what you're saying as far as I start with my DIY. Let's so like the piece behind me, we did, um, we've been doing a month long intuitive sessions in the creators club. So this is where I'm at. Yeah, I love it. And love so it. I start with my DIY paints and then I work forward into acrylics and you can even work so so many layers into it that your top layer you can even work with oils on the very top i've seen you do like the chalk oil thing too or oh yeah yeah the um pastels, the pastels oil pastels yeah mm -hmm. yeah I've not that to that. yeah i i do mark making with that but yeah, yeah. hello everybody hi derek how are you Thank you, Delissa. Delissa says she loves my hair, and I was just telling Kelly I haven't brushed it because I'm afraid it's going to... Yeah. <laughs> but thank you. Sometimes it Camera's looks better after deep. it gets a day or two right into the... Exactly. And it's no like, brushing. It's like my hair needs wash, so I'm like, well, it's a perfect day to just throw it in a braid and it'll stay. Otherwise, if it's too clean, it won't... Then it fret, yeah. It right out. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to start. Um, I don't see, I'm going to share the video, I guess. Hi, Christine. Hi, sis. My sis my is in the house. It freezes up. I don't understand why it does that. Okay. I have so, to keep coming out and coming back in. Really? 
Yeah, only on you know, my um, I don't understand it. Facebook has been really whack this week. So I'm not sure what is happening. But there it is. Christine's there. Derek's here. Um, your sister's here. Hello. Somebody's asking about someone's hubby, but I'm not sure if that's for you or for me because on my end it says Facebook user. Yeah, I have well, no idea. I don't see that. Yeah. It doesn't tell me who that is. So my hubby's doing good if you're asking about mine. Mine is too. So <laughs> everybody's good. All right, I'm going to start painting. So like I said, for the new people who came in, I'm doing a record with a, a heart for Valentine's Day and peace and love and hippie stuff. So yeah, love it. I have no idea what I'm doing, but this is my color palette for the underpainting. Love it. And um, we'll see how it goes because, you know, it's very slick on here. So I may have to dry and do a few coats, but we'll start. Oh, I almost dipped in my coffee first thing. Nice. <laughs> I better change it. Let me change the water and the coffee to the other side. Whoopsie. Yep. Painting 101. Although I have your, your coffee your colors kind of yeah. at your drinking cup and your water cup. Okay, yeah. so I have new products in. I'm so excited. Um, they were lost in the mail for a minute. So um, I got them. I got them. Now, the thing is, I just got them in last night, and I did not get them on my website. But as soon as I get done, I will rush over and add these to my site. Um, these are the brand new molds from the IOD company. Um, they have a micro rim on them, so that micro rim means that it's raised so when you go to um, clean off and, and make like a clean surface on the molds it's going to be nice and flat so these are fonts you guys that and is so cool if you look i'm going to hold it at an angle so you can see what i mean by the micro ridge you can see how it kind of is raised a little bit that is so nice um, I'm comparing this to their original version where there was no raised edge. This game changer. So, okay, so let me see. This one is called Harper. Oh, I like that. And oh, I like that font. That's my font for my my bits. Yeah. So this is like a like a typewriter. A typewriter. I yeah typewriter font. So very classic. Um, and let me know which ones you like best. Yes, Christine, it's cold here. I'm all bundled up though, so I'm not cold. Um, it's actually up to about in the warehouse here that I work in. It's probably up to maybe like 50 or not 50, yeah, 54. I probably got it up to like 54, 55 right now inside here. I'm at 73. I don't want to. <laughs> rub it in, girl. Just I don't want to make that belly. Right in. But I'm, right now I'm having a hot flash. <laughs> That's what I told her. I said, oh. she's like, oh, I'm sorry. It's so cold. I'm like, it's good because, you know, I'll be having hot flashes and I'll, it all evens out. So, you know. It okay. Evens out. Love, love, love this one. Yeah, my sis says it's we have sunshine today. We are so thankful for that. Any of you that are um, used to Ohio weather, we get a lot of cloudy days so when we do get the sun we're like ah. <laughs> yeah and here it's totally overcast and gray yeah so see you're getting what we get we're, we're getting the opposite right now yeah okay so the next font style that i'm going to show you the name of this one is called victoria Oh, and again, I will bomb's name. I will get these um, as soon as I'm done. I'll get these loaded onto the website. I ordered plenty because I think these are going to be a great 
cellar. And I'm going to hold this up close because if you see, it almost looks like little... Oh, oh it's got little things in it. it. Yeah, it almost looks like it has wood grain. Oh. Are you going to sample one right now? Yes, ma'am. Or today? Good. I don't know what I'm going to... I think I'm tempted. I think I need to use the wood grain one. What do you think? Yeah. Or what? I don't know. You like the other font, though, don't you? That's okay. The other font is um, is more common. So use the one that's that's not as common, which is the wood grain. I kind of want to yeah. see that. What does everybody else want to see? Yeah, what do you guys want to see? She said that she's, she just put her air conditioner on. Yeah. <laughs> that's the way it is. <laughs> yeah. She says, Kelly, is it cold there? You have gloves on, 45 layers and a hat. Yeah, I'm gonna say yes. I, yeah, you guys, I got new clothing in. Like literally, when I came in, this is how I was dressed when I came in, and then I got these. This is new. I got it yesterday, shipped in, and oh, ready. I, love that. I know it looks makes me look like a crazy homeless person with all. My <laughs> no, it doesn't. It's homeless chic. Okay. <laughs> it's literally shabby chic. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I love this. So I'm like, I'm just going to throw this on. It'll be warm. And then when I get hot, I'll just start peeling off the layers. But this just came in yesterday. I haven't shown it to anyone yet. It's not even on the website yet. So this is okay. an exclusive uh, reveal. Victoria. Okay, I got to vote for Victoria. And Victoria is the type set, the typesetting kind of one, the typewriter one. Oh, my sister's coming. Are you coming to like now? Oh, she says I'm coming to shop. Yes, girl. I got some cute stuff you might like. I thought you meant you were on your way. I was like, oh, <laughs> okay. well, is she coming to shop in your store? Well, she probably just meant sometime. I thought oh. she meant when I read that, I thought she meant she was on the right way. Right now. Okay. Yeah, I'm so going to turn my blow dryer on for one second. Go ahead. She said, no. She's she's at home in her studio, probably. Blazing. Okay. OMG, OMG. Look what just came out of my blow dryer and landed on my piece. What? What? Yeah. What is it? Hold on. Let me see if I can get. It's a bunch of. Glitter? No. Or dirt. Gold? Oh. It's texture. Well. That that's what so, it is. Okay, so here's the thing. It's I, texture. I, I yeah, I think you're gonna have a texturized finish. That's on okay. This one. I'll go over it. It's like a whole bunch of dirt. <laughs> <laughs> it goes it goes along with my homeless my homeless chic look. Okay. Yeah, it's like fur. <laughs> I don't know what the heck it is. Oh well, it is what it is. Danielle's on here. She says, hi, mommy. Hi, Danielle. All right, so I'm going to use the Victoria. Um, hi, Danielle. Hi, Danielle. Thank you for watching. That's my daughter. I know. How exciting. Your sister is glazing today. Yeah, this is her day and off. So. Said you look adorable, Kelly. <laughs> <laughs> you do not laugh. <laughs> well, thank you. Okay, so this is my little container that I have. I think I just got this from. Um, let me think. I've I've had this in my stock. I can't remember the name of the store. It's one of those dollars. Dollar Tree. That's what it is. I got this from Dollar Tree. And it's just a little glass jar. So I thought I would put something on it. So what would you guys like this to say? And then what I'll do is paint. <clears throat> paint. So, but I want to know what all of you think this little jar would be good for. Christine says, I grew up in New Hampshire, so I'm used to layers. So what do y'all think that this would be good for? Like, 
and then we'll figure out. I want you guys to tell me what word you want. I mean, make it like not, you know, make 13. it. I don't want it to be 13 letters or anything, but <laughs> how about um, hmm. love? Love. I was just going who said love rings and things. That's a create. lot of words. Create. Yeah, let's just keep it to one word. However, I do love that, Nancy. Rings and things. Things. What Spons. about lips? You could put lipstick in there. Harmony. Yeah, like what? Let's think about what What would you use this for? And then what word would you use? Like makeup. Yeah. But Or lips or It could be eyes. good for cotton balls. I could put balls on this. <laughs> You cannot put balls. <laughs> Wait for you to say it. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm really ornery this morning. <laughs> okay. What if you put um, art? A R T. Artsy. Art. Artsy. Bits. Art. Stuff. Crafts. Um, stuff. Derek Thanks. said stuff. I like stuff. that. Stuff. <laughs> Danielle says, your daughter says I should put balls. Oh, yeah. See, we're all the same. <laughs> we're horrible. I'm Danielle, sorry. Keep I'm, it safe, my I'm friend. I'm corrupting your daughter. <laughs> keep it safe, Danielle. Keep it family friendly. Family friendly. Um, Hi, Alyssa. Paper clips, Q tips. Okay. Brushes. brushes. I said brushes, yeah, or makeup or stuff. Jewelry. I'm going in with my second layer. Okay. In case anybody was wondering what I was doing. How about E T C? Wait, what's oh, happening? et cetera. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you cracked me up. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm letting my stupid show. <laughs> <laughs> What's ETC? X I'm like, what does that X mean? C Wait, what? Oh, that's so funny. And do one for tips and colors. Oh, tips. tips that's oh, cute. that would be really, that's good. Tips. That's really good for those of you that maybe have a little coffee shop in your place or, yeah. Or you're a parent and you would like tips for doing everybody's laundry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My sister said, quit talking, Kelly. <laughs> you know you're laughing, sis. <laughs> All right. So while I'm deciding that, so the first thing I'm going to do is warm up my clay because my clay is kind of cold from being in here. Um, the yeah, one thing I would say. Yeah. The one thing, when you open your clay, and this is air dry clay Let me put that up there. I do have this on my website um, you could do this with other things like I have a a little um, sugar you could put sugar on there someone sugar, sugar sugar yes smile um, but you could use this with um, hot glue like if you needed it in a quick pinch you know? Yeah. You don't have to necessarily use the paper clay, but the paper clay I really, really like because um, it's just, it's, it's fun to play with. It's easy. I like the paper it, clay because it looks kind of vintagey when it cracks. And it does. I've it actually does. never used the glue, so I really can't compare. Yeah. But. So when you use the glue and I've used those for, um, classes that I've had in house. So those of you that have workshops and have little businesses like ours, um, it's a really good option because it's one and done. It dries. Like, you don't have to dries. wait. Yeah. And you don't have to worry about when the people apply it to their little surface. You don't have to worry about them messing up the soft clay. So yeah, messing up it, the detail. Yeah, so it does have its benefits. And what do you use, a hot glue gun or the? I have a pot. I have like a hot glue pot. Oh. Like, yeah, and 
I mean, if you're in the business like we are, that's the way to go. Because what you can do is just um, spoon it and just pour it basically in your molds. So, oh, wow. That's yeah. awesome. All right. So I have chose of all the words I am, I have chose, um, let's see, I liked because of the time of year love because you know it'll be valentine's day next so i like love and then i also liked um let's see what was the other one that i liked i think derek uh, derek said stuff yeah that was so cute so tell me between those two everybody watching what do you want do you want love or stuff while I'm warming this up. Derek said treats. Nancy said stuff. But you could do this on anything. Um, stuff. I like them both and I can't decide. So they have to decide. Love. So far. And then you can put candy hearts. Okay. Oh, yeah. So the first thing you want to do is get your little brush, just an old brush. Yeah, that would be cute with the little candies in it. Here's my underpainting. I love that. Very marble. It almost looks like marble. I like the, I don't want, you know, like just mm -hmm. that's how I like it. And so that is um, acrylic, yellow ochre, and unbleached titanium. And then I'm going to do a little bit of the um, bright aqua green in the middle. But I'm sorry, I have to use my blow dryer again. Oh, that's okay. Was it super loud when I did it the first time? Uh -uh. Okay, good. Okay, so we're going to do stuff. We got two. We got two votes for that. So First thing I'm doing is I'm just taking my corn starch and I'm making sure I get that brushed into all the letters really well. <clears throat> yeah, and the then corn I'm just going to pinch stuff. off. These are a little bit smaller. Um, so I'm just going to. Now, which ones are you doing? The wood one? Yeah. And are they all capitals? Yes. And so the, the Victoria one is all lowercase. Correct. Okay. I'm just That's asking. a good point, actually. to do at this point is so I've got it in there you just want to get something flat so I have this little doohickey and it has a it's a like a art squeegee and I'm just going to use this to scrape it you can use anything though you can use a credit card actually probably need something a little harder And it doesn't take very much for this. Victoria is all, yes. I'm excited though. I have been, these have been in for a while. They've just been, um, I don't know, they've been traveling around our town apparently. <laughs> I'm glad they came in. I had these ordered clear back in I think October. I ordered these. So IOD now puts the names of the molds on them. Yes, I love that they do that too. They're getting, they just are constantly getting better and better. 
who is that that's um, speaking that says that said that about the IOD now puts the names because it says Facebook user. It's not giving me their name for some reason. I don't even see that. I'm reading I'm... from my StreamYard app, though, so it's not showing me everybody's name. Um, Brenda over on YouTube says, hello, ladies. I'm so glad I caught you live. Delisa. That's so weird, Delisa, that it's not showing your name because um, you've approved. It turned. It showed your name in the beginning. Yeah, it's so weird. Maybe she changed devices or something. And now I can't even find it. Girl up cycle. She lost us. Okay, let's see if these, I've got three. I got STU. Let's see how easy these come out. This is where it could be a little tricky because they're, they're minute, you know. So I'm going to start pulling it. Yeah, I can't see any comments. It's weird. You know, Alyssa and I did <clears throat> one of these on Sunday. I saw that. So and I I couldn't see the comments, but she could. So I don't know what's well that yeah, was fun. I who did has like the app. What? It who has the StreamYard app? Is it you or her? Um Alyssa did, and we're gonna switch like next Sunday we'll do on mine. So maybe that's so nice. Well, um, the person whose name the app is under is the person that can read all of them. So um, oh, that's it then. So like I can read all of them over here on my computer um, because what I can do is I've got this running in um, one of my private groups. Um, I've got an art and upcycled group that's free. Um, for anybody that wants to go in there just as a support group. Um, so I run this over there and I run it on my public page. And I also run this over on my YouTube channel. So um, it gives you options, right? You can even run this um, on your Periscope, which is Twitter. So you can run it over there too. I don't um, know. Okay, somebody is asking. I use this golden um, glazing along with my acrylic just to give it a little bit more open time yes. to dry and to make it smoother. Nice. Okay, Good. they came out really well. So I just want to say if I did not have the cornstarch inside the molds, I could really see me probably having some trouble pulling these out as well as I did because they're very skinny. You know, they're very Oh yeah, they're little. little. Um, okay, Brenda is asking, do you have some of the alphabet molds to sell? I have a bunch in. I just got my shipment in and Brenda, as soon as I get done here, I will load them onto my website. So, um, Give me a little bit after this ends. Maybe check back in an hour and it should be on my website. So that's at girlupcycledstudio.com. And Karen's item, she puts all of her items that she finishes in, you know, from our lives up for sale as well. And it's looking Yeah, gorgeous. on the website and on my Etsy. So I like pretty. the blue. I like this blue with the green with the Oh good. And then the heart will go in the middle. Oh, I'm having a hot flash. <laughs> <clears throat> I think we need to change the name of this, uh, our little show here. The Hot Flash Girls. Hot Flash, Hot Mess. <laughs> hot Flash, Hot Mess. That's a good one. What are you going to do? I think it's I have a big light on me, too. Um... Well, hi, Randy Rosser in the house. How are you, sir? Um, let's see. Dion has problems with StreamYard. She, yeah, I saw she was having trouble. I thought, it felt awful. I think it was yesterday I was trying to catch her and Quita 
um, and it looked like they were having trouble. I, I couldn't even, I, I couldn't watch it because it was so pixelated. So it was a bummer. So frustrating when you're. And I guess Facebook doesn't do the duo thing anymore, right? Oh, they don't? Oh, I don't know. I'm asking. Uh, well, I know in the groups they do. So maybe not publicly, but you can in a group. Thank you, Christine. Put my Aww, there. So Hi, Maria. Sweet. Maria and Ashley are watching. Either or or both. Good morning. Hi, Maria. I'm doing a a record. And I'm sweating even though it's 73 in here. <clears throat> I'm going to use my... You need my to come to Ohio. I know, right? It'll be... Yeah. I'll be freezing. Although I still get hot. So I'm running for fire again real quick. Okay, that came out pretty good. So I will, I'm going to reapply. So it gets two Fs. I'm going to reapply my, my um, cornstarch. So I really do. I think these will be, they'll give me some trouble if I don't do that. Okay. Make sure, like, my clay is already starting to dry out. Remember, this is just paper. It's, paper. it's made from paper. So I'm going to press it back in, and I'm going to get it covered. And what I want to do, I'm going to give a little spritz. A couple little spritzes with my water. And work it in. Recover re it. And on top of that, I'm going to put it in side my little paper or my little plastic baggie okay you can't yeah because when it dries out it you, you can't it's not as usable right it's harder to work with honestly yeah but you can reactivate it it takes a while but it can be done because of Bennett you know when I didn't know I was out of play before and I was trying to you know, use my last pieces. Right. So how's your week been so far? You been busy? Who, me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I'm closed on Monday, so I, the, my week started yesterday. So, yeah, I mean, yesterday wasn't too busy. But like, it's, you know, it's up or down. It doesn't, there's no rhyme or reason. If you mm -hmm. ask me what's my busiest day, I couldn't tell you because last Saturday was, you know, just busy, 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 nonstop. And then maybe the Saturday before that wasn't as busy. So there's no rhyme or reason to anything. Yeah. And yeah. I know that um, we call them the snowbirds, but the people from the North are down now. Yeah. So it might start getting even busier. But yesterday was kind of a rainy, gloomy day. So maybe that's what kept everyone away. Yeah. I had, you know, a few customers, but it wasn't like Saturday. Right. But like I said, there's no rhyme or reason. So there's that. Okay. So, gosh, I don't know. So now I'm going to do the heart. I'm going to figure out what color I'm going to use. <clears throat> oh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do my favorite was Canacridone. Oh, no, no. I'm going to do Cad Red if I can find it. I have Found a question. It. What's your question? I just grabbed the wood glue and I'm gluing on the glass. That's probably not going to stick very well, is it? It does. I've done it. It works. Gorilla glue? Yep. Okay. I usually do the quick and stick tight bond quick and thick. I've done it on glass. It works perfect. What's it called again? Tight bond quick and thick. You want me to get it so you can see the packaging? Uh, sh well, yeah, get it so you can show everybody else. Um, but yeah, I know I don't have that in house. And it's a wood glue. Hi, Lindsay. Oh, goodness. Karen, 
I love your sweater. Yeah, it's cute, isn't it? Thank oh, hearts. you. Here it is. Oh, okay. Tight bond. All right, cool. And this is a glass, and these are the molds. Oh, that looks really cool. And it's, I used it for my brushes mm -hmm. and see how the molds across the top. Oh, where's the mirror? Where's the thing? And then, so it's stuck. I, I did this like when they first came out a few mm -hmm. years ago. So, yeah. Okay, it was. So, I don't know. I'm it's just going to kill me. I have to use my blow dryer again. That's okay. I don't know if this is the way I should be doing this, but I'm, I'm going to just, hey, Lindsay. Like, I'm putting this directly onto the glass because the pieces are so little and I'm just going to put it on the glass because I'm going to paint over it. Yeah. You're painting over it anyway. So I'm just going to, it's yeah. easier. I never thought of doing that. That's brilliant. I'll put it on there and then I'll kind of wipe it I off. I always get it all over my fingers, but I do enjoy p pulling, picking, peeling glue off my fingers for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm getting hot now. You guys look like fun. We try to be fun. Oh, if it's not fun, I don't like to do it usually. I'm like, whoo! Hi, how are you? I'm good. I'm just waiting on my dog. I'm sorry. I was waiting. I'm waiting on my dog. No, no please look around. Look around. I'm doing a live, so don't worry about it. What, I'm actually live? on Facebook doing a live oh. painting. That's why. <laughs> oh my god! All right. You scare me to sure. death. But no, look around. I have albums back here and all kinds of uh, cool vintage stuff. So okay, so <laughs> you can say hi. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Good, not bad. What you oh, showing man, for? Our heart's got to settle down. <laughs> Usually I hear the bells. You know, I have like little bells on my door. No, don't worry. It's not your fault. But feel free to look around. Thank you. Okay, so I have a suggestion. Um, yeah. Before you start doing yours, measure it first. <laughs> So, so, and normally what you do, um, the U is your middle letter. So the way I normally do it, I wasn't thinking, um, I put my middle letter right smack in the middle and then I work from the middle out from each side. So it's all good. I'm just going to scooch it around here. It's organic. Mm, yeah. <laughs> You're like, mm, whatever, Karen. Okay. I just lightly it's, it'll be fine it'll be all right okay it's to you okay there we go we're good now that scared me to death <laughs> that's so funny <laughs> did, I, did i look like i was <laughs> <sighs> oh, you probably scared him when you jumped I, I don't know what I did. <laughs> oh, that was good. You should work with your turn the other way around so your back's not to your customers when they walk in. Well, my side is to my customers, but I had the blow dry. Yeah, I should, I'm usually at this desk over here to my right that faces the window. Mm -hmm. But it's just easier because all my stuff is over here. 
so I decided to know it's a whole thing now how it goes. So, so I'm just it, mixing cad red and black to do um, the beginning of my heart. Pretty. Oh, that's cute. Still. It's kind of got like a Western feel to it. You know? Yeah, it really does. Cause it has, yeah. It just looks like twigs or something. It's real organic. Oh, well, yeah. And I'll have to see it when you, once you paint it, everything, you know, the details will come out. So I'm wondering, I bet you, since I have glue on here, it's going to crackle when I paint it, won't it? <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Unless yeah, I let it dry. It'll be okay. Well, you can take a paintbrush with water and kind of brush off around the edges if you want. I guess. I don't know. What do you think? About I don't know. That? I'm almost like, maybe I should just... See if the whole thing will crackle. I don't know. Yeah. All right. Break time for coffee. I need a drink after that thing. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, Karen said, you best be getting to painting that, Kelly, Lindsay. All right, Lindsay. Um, paint a whole jar with glue, somebody says. I, that must be Delissa. I just want to um, show a trick that I do for painting hearts. I make a line right down the center and then just do the loopy on each side. Mm-hmm. Kind of easier for me. Hey, Heather. To, you best be getting to painting that. Somebody, <laughs> somebody suggested just painting the whole thing with the glue, so I'm just going to, I'll just paint put it the on there. I'm, we're experimenting here. Okay, let's just see what happens. Um, the Dollar Tree is where this little jar, they have all kinds of little containers and stuff there. So it's just a great way to do a little home craft, huh? Yeah. Or you could totally just use a jar that you've used at your home and that way you're upcycling it, right? All right. True. Yeah. All right, so the glue's on there. I'm going to go ahead and start painting while the glue's still a little moist. And then I'll have to probably hit it with my dryer to get it to crack. Glue it all. And do you have crystal chips? You can roll. Ooh, I don't. Crystal chips? I'm sure I have something. I'd have to dig for it, though. Hello, hello, whoever just said hi, ladies. Um, okay. So what color? That's, that's, I was just thinking like when I first, when, before we went live, like that's my worst thing is what color do I do? Do you guys want it like a, a color color? Like something vivid or do you want a neutral? I'm going to let the people watching pick. Well, that's an easy way out. <laughs> and I can't glass. see glass at the moment, so. Oh, I love sea glass. Yes. Okay. Sea glass it is. Sea glass for the win. I'm going to go grab it. Oh my goodness. This is kind of, I'm going to get a new one. This is kind of my seat is glass it? is dried out. And I did reactivate it and everything, but I don't want to take the time to do that. And so what I'll do is the really <laughs> thick one that I have, a lot of times what I do with that is I will trowel it on and I'll use that for texture um, on my furniture pieces, or you can do raised stencils. So it's really cool. Oh yeah. Heather, um, 
No, that's not. I'm not sure who's asking. Um, how much do you sell your painted records for? Forty-five. That's a steal. Is original, it? Original art for forty-five bucks. Yes, that's good. That is good price, I think. All right. So when you are painting um, your piece, remember that your clay is still wet, okay? Right. Because usually it takes like overnight to dry, right? Yes. And sometimes it's hard to wait. Yes. And it's not like you can blow dry it. Right. Now, what will happen if you do blow dry it, it'll make it crack the uh, clay, oh, yeah. which is actually could be a fun thing. Right. Yes. I did. Um, I did a few custom mermaid ornaments this last year for Christmas. Mm hmm. And one of, oh, actually, one was our first live. That's what we did, the ornaments. Mm -hmm. And her arm broke. Yeah. So I glued it back on and it cut. So I just said she had a really rough 2020. Because <laughs> there was like a crack in her arm. Yeah. Uh, but she did. She had a rough 2020. We're all going to have some uh, scars from that one, aren't we? Yeah. But that's okay. So why not the mermaids too? All right. Now I need my white. So I'm trying to be really careful, guys. And I'm trying to stipple it in a little bit. If I don't like the crackle, I'll just paint over it. You know what? You might be able to just peel the glue off. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. Well, if I do that, then I'll probably pull the letters off. Wouldn't I? Oh, true. Oh, I like this color I just invented. What's that? It's cad red and the unbleached titanium. Oh, yeah. This one. Very pretty, like a corally. It looks coral yeah. on my end. Yeah. For a highlight. Mm-hmm. What are we going to do next week? That's a good question. <laughs> I have um, these boxes that I wanted to paint. They're like hat boxes. Oh, cool. They're like three that go into one another. I'll show you. Uh, oh, like uh, stackable. Or yeah, but these are a little different. They're made out of wood. Cool. This is what they look like now. Oh, very cool. So what do you think? And they're all textury. Oh, and they look great. kind of steampunkish because of the little rivets on them. Yeah. So I was thinking all rusty and but making it look rusty with paint and stuff. That's that was my thought process. Okay. This is how it's looking so far. And I'm Oh, it looks so cute. I'll hold it upside down. Very cute. Stuff. Um, and so I'm going to hit that. Yeah, nesting boxes. That's it. Yeah. Uh, the, somebody says, the sea glass and the turquoise on Karen's look a lot alike. It really does. I was thinking the exact same thing. Isn't that funny? All right. I'm stuck holding it now. <laughs> I'm stuck with this. What the hand? Karen, yes, do that. They want to see you do the nesting box. Those boxes? Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. I'm set for next week. All done. Okay. <laughs> what, what could I do? <laughs> I'm literally... 
<sighs> running in here like what am I gonna well it was this week's was easy because I have new stuff in and I'm, yeah you, you know, know when you get new stuff. toys you want to play with them so that was my my thing all right I was too eager with this because I need to let the let bottom layer dry and I did not so right now I'm hitting Hey, Lisa Bell. Getting the jar with some air. Kim. It should start to crackle a little bit. Christine said to do another hat. Oh, okay. I think I have one in stock left for painting. What would you like to see on the hat? Want more flowers? That would be good because so what I'm thinking about is spring, spring inventory. So spring and summer. It is crackling just a bit, but it's, it looks like a hot mess right now <laughs> while it's drying. So when it dries, it lightens up. It is crackling. I don't like a ton of crack. I'm not a big crackle person, but I kind of had to go with it this time. And what I'll do is if, if, I'm, if I get done with it and I don't like it, I'll just do another layer. Oh, the back of a pink car Hi, with flowers on it. Hi, Mary. Maybe I should do that again, Heather. this pretty thick because of the, the letters, so it's taken it a minute. Can you guys hear the hair dryer? Not bad. Okay, good. Oh, Heather, you're saying paint that on the hat. Hey. Didn't even think of that. Paint What did she say to paint on the hat? Mm -hmm. What did she say to paint on that? Oh, that's pretty. The, um, I don't know if you remember last year, I did the vintage pink car with all the flowers coming out of it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's saying paint that on the hat. Oh. So. Might be on to something. All the girls are in. All the ladies. Okay, so I think I need to do another coat on this. Just saying. Because I'm not I'm not really digging it like this. go ahead and do another coat and then what I could do is um, I think all of the the letters 
I could kind of rub a little bit of, I don't know, metallic or something. Make it pop a little bit. Glass is very hard. Um, it's a hard surface and it does not absorb. So be careful when you're painting over that you're not pulling back off, okay? Yeah, you have to let it completely dry. Mm -hmm. Completely. You must be really getting into it now. We're not talking much. <laughs> I'm trying to let my stuff dry, but so far I'm... Can you see it? Let me see. So cute. I have to go in with my darker colors now. Mm -hmm. Cute. Because it looks like cocky poopy. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> Shoot. Um, oh, can you do graffiti flowers on a hat? Yes. Yeah. What probably. are graffiti flowers? Like, yeah, I would say yeah, I could do that. What are graffiti flowers? Um, I do you mean with the spray paint? Or it would have like, you know, that really loose graffiti feel, I guess. Uh, let's see. Angela, I remember the first thing I saw Kelly paint was a wicker peacock chair. So fun. Seems like a long time ago and not sure why I thought to share that now. <laughs> really? That was. That's, that? when I, that's when I, I think maybe might have been the first year I opened up this local studio here. Really? Um, and I did yeah. a ombre, um, ombre effect with the peacock chair yeah and a local yoga um, studio bought that so so this is how it's looking like Let's see stuff so i'm gonna let that dry hello dre Sheila. Thank you, Mary. Drop my pen. So, how is everyone doing? I, uh, Kelly's looking at comments. <laughs> I don't see any comments, so I can't answer anybody. And I'm dropping everything on my dusty ground. 
I can't see comments, so I don't know. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, so I'm thinking I should do probably, I should probably seal it. Maybe do a, hit the top of the letters with some metallic or something. <laughs> My sister says, y'all should call us What the Heck Wednesday. You're cracking me up today. <laughs> <laughs> Hot Do mess, you hot. sell those hats that you have on? It's really cute. The one I have on, no, but I will tell you where I got it from. I got it from um, Melissa's. Let me go. Oh, I can't look it up. Hold on. A little, a little. Let me go find it. Yeah, it does. It makes. Okay, let me just hold that thought. Um, somebody said it looks like a real clay pot. That's exactly what it's doing. So if you look, I'm going to try to get the camera up close see if it'll if I can hold it still and it kind of made little cracks and crevices in it yeah and it looks like like a potter little piece of pottery now um okay let me find you right let's see if I can find her page I love this hat. I just got it. And look at the I little my heart, just so you know. Yeah, it's so cute. It's a slouchy hat. Yeah, a little beanie. Um, and I got it from one of my friends. Let me find her page so I can. Is Melissa Scott. No, not Melissa Scott. Wait a minute. That was her last name. I'm using Hold the blow dryer again. Oops. Oh goodness, I'm going to have to find her page and put it in here when I get done. There she is. It was the one. Oh, I was going to say, I thought it was Melissa Scott, but the wrong one came up. Okay. And the name of her place is Cornerstone Antiques. Okay. Cornerstone Antiques. And she does live sales. Um, so I'm going to try to... There we go. There you go. So if you look on the screen, that is her Facebook page and she does live sales and I bought this during a live sale. And she has lots of cute stuff, vintage, all kinds of vintage antique stuff and then she has a little bit of like odds and ends like hats and gloves and things like that. So that's Melissa Scott at Cornerstone Antiques. Oh, thank you. Karen, how did you curl your hair? It's natural. I can do anything. That is my hair. Thank you for asking whoever said that. Okay. This, this is um, wash and wear. <laughs> <laughs> it's beach hair. Beach hair yeah. don't care. Beach hair don't care. I have a hat like that. I almost wore it too. But my roots aren't that bad, so I, I don't have to wear the hat exactly yet. Soon. I'm going to throw, throw a little bit of... Uh, the pennies from heaven. This is a copper metallic. Most of the time I shake it really well and then I just take the lid, tap my finger into it, and then I'll just lightly cover the letters or whatever you could do, you know, anything you want to accent. But, um, the detail on this one, again, you guys, the name of this one is Victoria. 
and it's more earthy looking. It looks like kind of twigs. And I do have this in. It'll be on the site here in a little bit. But when you rub the glazing patinas over this, um, you could even do this with wax, whatever. Um, but it makes the details pop a little bit more, okay? I just covered it. Oh, cute. I just covered the whole thing. What, you didn't like it? No. <laughs> no, I'm oh, starting just keep over. Going. Yeah, I'm starting over. I like that much better. <laughs> Trim the rim in metallic. I like that. Whoever said that, let me see. I will do that. That's the thing with acrylic, though. It doesn't dry as quick as um, the DIY paint. Yeah. Yeah. So, but that's okay. I'm going to use some golden ticket on the outside of mine. Well, you so know, I think guys, I'll do that while I'm waiting for the inner part to dry. Yeah. So that's the thing, guys. You know, it's not rocket science, you know. It, it's paint literally if and you, you don't like it, it oh that looks good if you don't like it you just repaint it. it okay now this will need uh, i'll do a clear coat or something on this as well um and then that'll seal it really nice and here's a tip if your stuff if you can't get your top off bang it on the floor two or three times really good and it'll open right up <laughs> It does. <laughs> it works. Take out your frustrations. Yeah. Ooh, maybe I'll do a little spray drippy drip. Let me put this on. Yeah, that's this turned out better than what I thought. So I, not that I doubted myself, but when I, when the glue was starting to glob up on me, I was like, oh, I don't know. But it kind of, that's, you know. You went with it. I just, I just went with it. Thanks, guys. No, it looks like a rose, Karen. That's what Heather says. What looks Heather, like a rose? Your art. Oh, it's a heart. It does look like a rose, right? Mm. Oh, I haven't used Golden Ticket in a long time. I I miss it. Yeah. I feel like this needs. I, I'm going to seal it. I'm going to use. I'm going to grab my. Here it is. My clear seal. And the thing is, it's still. A little, I hate that I have to keep turning the dryer on. I know. That's how I felt. So I'm trying what not. What happens during lives, it's real time, guys. So those of you that catch this on the replay, because we are on YouTube, and we'll have a lot of people that want to catch this later, just fast forward during, you know, when we have the dryers on. I can actually hear you pretty good, and I don't hear your dryer that oh, much. Good. I don't know. Mine sounds like it's super airplane coming through, but that's to me. Somebody, Christine is asking if you're going to post your new clothes the on what? your, if you're going to post your new clothes. Yeah. Your, so I got new stuff in. Um, so I, I would like to do another um, online sale. As soon as I get it, everything priced and tagged, you know. So I got a lot of work to do. Ooh, what if you drip metallic down like a honey pot? I love that. I love that idea. Okay, so I just changed my mind. I'm going to do the Hi, clear. How are you? I'm going to do some clear wax. And I'll be right back. I'm going to grab that. I'll 
If you have any questions, let me know. I'm on a Facebook Live at the moment. That's okay. Yeah. So you can say hi. Hello. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Our customer says hi to everybody. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Happy shopping. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to use my pixie brush. Um, okay, so I changed my mind as far as the top coat. I'm going to go ahead and do um, clear wax on this because I don't want it to get overly shiny. I want to keep it to where it looks, you know, like a little clay pot. So notice it changes color when we put that on. Did you get two coats of the same color? I did of the sea glass? Right. Yes. yes, I did. Thank you. Have a great day. I get people who, um, I have a dentist next door and so they stop by just to see what's While going they're out on. And about. I don't know if you can see the gold and the glitter in here. I did a little. It's very wet right now because yes, I sprayed. Yes, yes, I can. But see I it. like the drips and the gold. Oh, that looks good. That looks so pretty with that turquoise back behind it. Yeah, it really I love that. Yeah. And then I'm gonna let this dry because that's my nemesis. I can't let things dry. Yeah, we like instant gratification, don't we? Right. Okay, so I'm almost done, but so this is the clear coat, and then I'm gonna go ahead and use some dark wax around the words and around a little bit of the crevices and stuff, and I think that's gonna like make it look really cool. So we'll see. Um, all of these items you guys can find on my website too, by the way, as well as Karen's. Okay. I'm not putting any more water on it. I refuse. I'm going to be a good girl. And not... <laughs> but there it is. Cute. I'm trying to get it without a glare and it looks really good in person. It's so glittery. Love yeah. it. Well, um, we will put finished pictures up. Especially yes. over, over on my face or my YouTube channel, I put the finished photos up of our work. And then that way we can, you can see the final. Right. So I am just painting this right where the cracks and crevices are. This is what it looks like now. It's changing a little bit, isn't it? And now I'm going to wipe it off. And you're just going to kind of lightly remember this whole time. You want to keep in mind that your clay is still soft. It's not hardened yet. So you want to be careful and just use kid gloves. You guys aren't going to probably be able to really make it out, but putting that dark wax on is making all of the, the little crackles pop as well. That looks really good, Kelly. Thank you. Not bad for just a little Dollar Tree jar, huh, guys? What are you going to do today, Karen? Yeah. I have a piece of furniture that I'm working on. Do you? And so you might be able to see it in the background. 
No, you can't. And I don't even know which way to turn the camera. <laughs> we could do some furniture oh, that looks painting really sometime. Good. I thought about doing it, but yeah. Yeah, you can do whatever you want. I mean, when we do these lives, we're basically just in our studios working on products that we're going to be selling in our studio. Right. So, yeah. I think it turned out cute. So as this dries, it'll lighten just slightly. But what will happen is you'll be able to see all the little cracks. Yeah, because I can't see the cracks. I'm even looking at, I can't see them right now. Oh, it looks so good, though. I love that stuff. <laughs> so yeah. cute. You could really get creative with, with this kind of thing, with the letters. So I'm excited that we have those. So cute. I love it, Karen. I love that. So are you... <laughs> Are you planning on like putting like putting any word across it or doing anything? I might do a stencil or something. I'm not sure. I've got to let I got to walk away and then I've got to let it dry or I'm going to yeah. ruin it. Yeah. So I got to let it dry, but I might do a stencil of some sort. Like, like, what would I it love be? you or something? These would be something rock and roll though. Oh. Love hurts. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Like you know, that. like a rock and roll song with, yeah, that everybody would connect with because she, if y'all don't know, she sells a ton of vinyl in her vintage store. And so I think that would probably resonate. Oh, with, that's a good one. Yeah. It's just different um, rock songs and stuff. Love stinks. That's oh, a good that's one. A good yeah. One. Yeah. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> good All idea. Right. Glad I thought of it. No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Yours, girl. It's all you. You do it, girl. All right. Anything else? So that else? was fun. All right. Everybody's loving it. Loving all the stuff. Oh, God, Thanks, done. Derek. Fun. Thanks, Derek. Love it, Karen. Thanks, Sheila. So cute, Kelly. Carolyn says, I'm on late. Karen, what are you spraying on your piece? I just sprayed water on it. Uh, I put oh. the golden ticket on and then sprayed water. So I don't know if you, is it even coming up the glitter? You can mm -hmm. see it. Yes. Okay. Yes, girl. I see that. I and see the drip. Mm -hmm. Christine says crazy on you by heart. That would be cool. Oh yeah. Yeah. You have a lot of options. I have so. a lot of options with so the word love in it. See. All right. So I think that's it for today. So if you want to hang out and just be goopy with us again, we'll be here next Wednesday at 11. Wow. You can catch Karen at Vintage Vibes Good Finds. And her items are for sale on there. If you don't see what you're looking for, just give her a call. Yeah, and then call uh, my everything at my place is at girlupcycledstudio.com. And you're welcome to call me if you can't find what you need. So, all right. Have a great. Oh, I know. I wanted one more question. Yeah, go ahead. Um, your candles are they up yet? Are you? Did you get them yet? Um, I'm still working on the labels, but I do. Okay. I do just have my small batch that I ordered, but it's they're not my own. But they'll be in. Um, okay. They're coming. I was. Just um, and I have lots of cool new things that came in yesterday that'll be hopefully in a live sale i'll be doing soon as soon okay. as i get it all prepped and ready so cool. okay i was just asking cool beans all right all it was right. fun all right uh, love you all we'll rest see, of the week we'll see you all next wednesday next same wednesday. time same channel same bat station same batch <laughs> yeah <laughs> right all right bye everybody Bye.